Hello, my little boobalas. Welcome back. I hope you are all doing fantastic. And, um, yeah, it's been a hot minute, right? Yeah, just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay, guys, before I get into anything else, I am using a new mic, trying it out. Hopefully, I'll be able to make it sound good. Fingers crossed. My apologies, if not. And let's hope I don't end up having to re-record this. Okay, I've tested it. And I'm iffy about the sound. So we'll see. But guys, so much has been going on. Um, I know the channel has been very inconsistent as of late. Um, I know some of y'all know, but I know a lot of you may not. I, I went through a lot of health issues, had to have some surgery. Um, a lot of new medications that really messed with my body. I think they finally found the right combination for my body i'm starting to feel a little more normal i don't know if that's good or bad considering it's me but hey but in the midst of all of this i did manage to do something yeah i managed to re-release the original rise let's see if i can get it up here to the camera right yes with a new cover a uh, new format inside, and I tweaked the content a little bit. So, and I also did the same thing with Rise Mind Over Matter. Oh, the camera's not liking me right now, is it? Huh. There we go. I like the way this this cover turned out particularly. Uh, it's getting a glare on it. But I really like the way this cover turned out. And... I finally released the first installment of Sandbox. I am so excited. Don't get me wrong. I'm proud of the other two. I love them. But this one, I, I don't know. Just There's something very special about Sandbox for me, and I don't know how to describe it. And I think most writers would get it. Um, I took more time with this one. I learned more about the way formatting works. I, I learned a lot, just put it this way. It was a, very much a learning journey for me. And, and, and at, at first, I kind of held myself back a lot with Sandbox. I would get several pages, sometimes even chapters done. And just hate them rip it up to start over that was part of what the delays were about um that wasn't the only reason for the delays but it, it was a big part of it and i eventually realized i was really going against my own advice oh if y'all can hear my puppy dog i apologize he's been a little sick um he's got a little bit of kennel cough going on and they think he may have some other health issues he's he's no boy he's no boy give me one second let me take him. I'll be right back. Oh, okay. I'm back. <laughs> Had to give him a little water, a little bit of medicine, then he need to go out and potty. And I swear to God, it's hotter than three Hades out there. Ooh. Yeah. I'm thanking my daughter for this fan. Very much so. Very much so. Oh, air conditioner has been pushing it all day. It is still too hot. Oh, great. Messed my hair up. Oh, well, y'all have seen me worse, right? <laughs> okay, back again. Had to ooh, go get the front door. <laughs> Why is it nobody wants anything until I tried to talk to y'all? Hmm? 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 But anyway, guys, as I was saying, um, same boss was a learning process. And... Like I had said, I, I went against my own advice. I've always said, trust your characters. They will tell you where you're supposed to go. Oh, hitting this new mic. <laughs> but I didn't trust my characters, and they made me pay for it 
quite a bit. I tried to think of, it's going to sound silly, but kind of what's trendy, what would be expected, this, that, and the other, and it didn't work. When I finally let go and trusted my characters and let them lead me, I was very happy with where they took me. So, and I'm hoping you guys will be too. Now, Sandbox features some of your favorite characters from Rise, but also introduces some new characters, some that I think you guys are really going to love and some that I'm really hoping you're going to hate. And that's all I'll say about that. Um, you get it on my website or on Amazon. I will include links below. Um, you can get the new versions of Rise and Rise Mind Over Matter in the same places. So, yeah, just check it out. Now, there was something else I want to talk to you guys about. And it has something to do with this this person looking over my shoulder back here. Do, do you guys see him back there? This purple person? This person. We finally got our thick 44s in. And I am so happy and just for you guys, I'm going to take him out of the box. Otherwise, he's going to stay in the box because I ain't having nothing happen to him. I swear. But let's get him out. Now, it did have a, another box on the outside of this, like a sleeve. Um, I already took that off. But, and I thought I had the exact spot I wanted him picked out here in my office. And I've come to realize I don't like that spot. You can't see him quite as well. So I'm working on rearranging. All right, here we go, guys. Say hello to the Wyvern King. I think these things turned out really well, and I think Thick, I think he would have been proud of them. I do. I think he would have been very proud of them. And I know they sold out awfully quick. I'm so glad we got to get ours. I got one. Gray got one. We're very thrilled. And I don't know. He's always going to be missed. If you're part of the Nabes community, hell, if you're part of the gaming community in general, you know Thick's going to be missed. But it's kind of nice and kind of comforting to know he's sitting back here and I can just look across the office anytime I get ready and he's there. So, anybody who got one, I hope you feel the same way about yours that we do about ours. We're both very proud of them. And uh, long live the Wyvern King. Now, there's one other thing I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, a couple of things, actually, if I'm being honest. For one, um, as I explained to my Discord family, and you should really go check out our Discord. See them, Stars Town Square. We are trying to build an honest-to-God community there, not just place where we post things sometimes but we want to build a whole community a family over there and we've got quite a few pretty damn awesome family members already so yeah I'll put a link to that below as well um but as I explained to those guys after going through all the illness and um some deaths in the family as well I was kind of mentally out of it just to be honest I would try to stream, try to record, but just things weren't, things were off, to be honest. So after I did that last stream a couple of weeks ago, I sat down, I got to thinking, what direction do I really want this channel to go as far as my YouTube channel and my Twitch channel and our business, my right, and I got to thinking about all of it and I realized I needed to change and prioritize some things that I haven't been. And then I realized, okay, during all this sickness and, and everything that's been going on, everything here has gotten so disorganized. It, it's not functional. It, it won't function 
to make the things happen that I want to happen. So that's kind of where I've been the past couple of weeks is just working on getting all work areas restructured, organized, set up in a way to be as productive as possible. And while I've been doing that, I have realized exactly what I want for my channels my writing or business, the whole nine, and what I need to do to get there. So there's going to be some shift in some things. Some things are going to stay the same, um, but there's just going to be a lot happening. So I'm I'm just hoping you guys will be okay with it all. I'm hoping you'll stay with me on the ride, you know. And one of the things I wanted to ask you guys about too, uh, I was having a conversation with somebody that I had met a while back and have come to think a lot of. Uh, he goes by Realism Games. I, I just call him Real. Um, I will put a link to his Twitch channel below. Awesome Scotsman. Go check him out. A hell of a storyteller. Hell of a storyteller. But we were discussing writing and such the other night. And um, it made me realize that, you know, a lot of people that may have wanted to write and have held back, uh, whether it be because of self-doubt because of the writing industry itself, you know, thinking, you know, the, the 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 big houses are the only way to go, things like that. It made me realize a lot of people may still not realize how much has changed in the industry thanks to the internet and a lot of other things. So I thought about sitting down and doing a video just discussing that. Um, just, you know, my thoughts on it. I'm no expert by any means, but just my thoughts on it and what I've discovered through my writing journey over the years. Would, would you guys be interested in that? Just let me know in the comments and babies, give me a week or two to finish getting everything around here done and set up. We're going to get more consistent. We're going to have new stuff. Um, we're going to develop some stuff that is going to be just like, what's the best way to put it? Staples, I guess you'd say. Staples in the channel and in the community. We're going to do a lot of stuff. And hopefully I'll learn to quit knocking around this new mic and hopefully it works out. But just give me a week or two. We're going to get all of that situated and things are going to get on a normal routine. And we're going to have fun. So just hang in there with me just a little bit longer. Now, I'm not, I, I am going to try to squeeze in a couple of videos, maybe a couple of streams during this time period, but I'm not going to promise when or what they're going to be. But I will promise after a week or two, this stuff should be to a manageable point where I can go ahead and get the staples put in place and get on a consistent schedule. So, just hanging in with me for a little bit longer. All right, guys, I am fixing to get out of here by all means. Go grab your copy of Sandbox, please, and share. Just tell people about it. Spread the word. Uh, Cap and I have discussed a lot of big plans that we really want to see happen. So, and the best way for those things to come true and to happen is for word to get spread. So, just tell everybody, okay? But all right, my babies, I'm out of here for now. Thank you so very much for hanging out with me and listening to my crazy ramblings today. It's very much appreciated. You guys are all truly appreciated. Now, until next time, guys, as always, keep reaching for the stars and aiming high. I promise you, you may not see the results this minute, but eventually you will, and you will not disappoint yourself. All right. Catch you guys later. Bye, babies.